hello loves welcome back to my channel or welcome in if you're new i know it's been a long time today is november 25th it's black friday yesterday was thanksgiving and as you can tell excuse the banging and ruckus i do have animals but as you can tell by the title i'm pregnant i'm pregnant i'm so excited i, I oh my god you have no idea how excited i am so yesterday i took a pregnancy test and i got my bfp my big fat positive oh that felt amazing but the day before so november 23rd i did take a test that night and it came back with the faintest of line but i was using the amazon cheapies the easy at home pregnancy tests and they they're like that so it, it's literally very faint and it doesn't get very dark until you're much further along i uh found out when i was 13 dpo with a very 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 faint line and i went crazy and i probably took like five tests that day all of them obviously came back with the same little faint line i wish i didn't do that i wish i would have spread them out because now i have to buy more <laughs> but the next day uh, first thing in the morning, I took another one and it was again a very faint line on the cheapy. So I waited till my husband went to work <laughs> and I ordered me some more pregnancy tests and I couldn't stop. I just kept going. So in the clip, it will show me taking the this cheapy and then it will show me taking the first response. <laughs> However, when I went to do the clear blue, my phone, my camera died, and then I meant to show you my reaction, but I forgot to hit play, and I got too excited to record. So it's the next day, and I will be showing you this. On top of that, I took a digital too. So I'll be showing you all of that. <laughs> and I took another two pregnancy tests this morning. I need to buy more because uh, I do want to do a line progression because I am high risk pregnancy and seeing as to yesterday when I had my big fat positive I couldn't call an OB because it was Thanksgiving and then today I can't call an OB because it's Black Friday and then you have the weekend so I have to wait till Monday and I just want to reassure myself that my HCG levels are rising so I do want to get more pregnancy tests just to test that out and then Lord knows how long it's gonna take before I can actually get into my appointment so I don't want to leave anything at risk it took me and my husband five years to get pregnant and it's finally here I'm <laughs> I'm so mind blown um, so my cycle is normally like 27 cycle days and I'm not supposed to have my period till Sunday and yeah I tested early because for a while for like a week and a half my boobs have been so sore I couldn't wear anything that would rub on them or push on them I could barely touch them they, they're a little tender now they're not as bad as it was a week ago and I'm like okay that that's that's a little suspicious you know I'll, sometimes they can associate people can associate you know tender boobs and headaches and whatever to menstrual but for me those are not my symptoms for menstrual symptoms like I, I'll get slight little cramps for right before you know my period AF is supposed to show but not the tender boobs and not the headache and when I say <laughs> I've had the worst headaches like yesterday after finding out obviously I was like super excited but my head was just pounding like, I, I just wanted to cry. Thanksgiving was the best, but not the best day. Like, the best because I found out I was pregnant, and there's nothing can bring me down on that. But my headache was just, it was there. It was pulsing. <laughs> so those are two of the symptoms. I mean, honestly, that's it. Like, I didn't get any implantation cramps or implantation bleeding. I mean, it's still kind of early. Um... My app says I'm three weeks and six days now. So, like, yeah, it's still early. I can possibly still have implantation bleeding. I'm hoping not because, yeah, that's scary. <laughs> it 
it's scary in my situation because like I said I'm I'm high risk and I just need to hurry up and get into the hospital or to the OB to make sure everything's okay and yeah I'm just, I'm just so excited I do have this is baby number two I do have my son he is 13 years old so there's a very very big gap in between this baby and my son uh, but he's still extremely excited he's been telling me that he really wanted a brother or sister and I'm just so happy that we're there and I'm just gonna keep a positive mind and a positive vibes that way I believe in that stuff I believe in your vibes and your positive attitude will <laughs> I don't want to say make things better but it's gonna help you know and yeah it's just like so many negative things has happened this year that finally having a positive something anything especially a positive pregnancy test is amazing and it, it just it fills my heart I'm just super super excited for this so I'm gonna go ahead and let you see the clip of me finding out that I'm pregnant and then we'll meet back here and I'll show you the tests so today is 14 DPL and it is November 24th and yesterday 13 DPO I did excuse that I, I don't know what's going on right there but yesterday I did take tests <laughs> I took four tests yesterday um, and I'll show you all right so they're very very faint but yeah they're there and then this morning I took ugh, these two and they're faint lines so I went ahead and bought more tests and that's what we're doing today I'm so nervous let me I'm gonna start with the very cheaper one if the line shows up I'm shaking if the line shows up I will go ahead and do the first response because those are not cheap <laughs> I am hoping and praying that this is real I am shaking so bad I won't mess up and throw away my pee this time <laughs> but I have to wait five minutes I'm gonna cover this up so I won't look at it I'm shaking so bad it's covered when I say I'm nervous <laughs> I'm nervous I can't believe this is happening like actually happening um, I'm hoping it actually happens I'm hoping it sticks oh god I don't know how long it's been <laughs> I'm so nervous. I'm just gonna look because I'm new. So far I don't see anything. We definitely see something in the other tests. I just gotta breathe. <laughs> I just got to breathe. I am such an impatient person. I'm doing the first response. <laughs> Why do they do this to the pregnancy test? It's like they don't want you to open it. <laughs> okay. Or is it just building up anticipation? First response. First response takes forever for it to load in. It's going. I'm gonna cover it. Okay, it's really, really faint. I doubt you guys are gonna be able to see this. It's there. I gotta breathe. <laughs> I had a breeze. I'll be back with you guys when it's time. All right, so it's been five minutes. I haven't looked yet. I have to breathe. I'm oh, like every video, and I've watched plenty of them. Every video, somebody they're always shaking, and it's like I already have faint lines, but getting any type of line on my first response that will blow my mind because that's real. Okay. Okay. We're looking. It 
it's weird where it's, it's located, but oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, let's see if I can do this without shaking. Oh. Okay. When I see these videos, I'm like, why do they keep taking so many freaking tests? It already said positive. But that, that, that doesn't matter. <laughs> I can't get the thing open. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, this is aggravating. Please open. Alright, starting with this cheapie. This was yesterday. You can definitely see the line. And after that... I took the first response and then here's the results to the clear blue that you were not able to see and then after that I was just too excited to stop and I took a digital and it says yes I really wish I would have caught my reaction on this but I was just so excited and then this morning I took these two so I took that one and then I took that one so comparing this cheapie from yesterday I think the line is darker my so far line progression on the easy at home tests so you could barely see it but this is 13 DPO and then it slowly progressed and this one's from today so 48 hour difference I think it's getting darker. I told you I got super excited and I couldn't stop. This is in a span of three days. <laughs> this is me being super excited yesterday and I was like, I gotta draw something. <laughs> this is my baby book for right now. Super, super exciting. I, wow, is all I can say. I'm just so, so happy. Cannot wait for this journey. It's so I will be uploading this this video uh, in, I want to say in a few more weeks because I, I don't want to keep it for too long because no matter what, I, I want to remember this and I want to remember this feeling. So I will be seeing you guys later. I probably am going to wait until I can reach my OB before I close this vlog off. But for right now, I love you guys. Momo, wanna say bye? I'm gonna be a big sissy. And you bye. <laughs> See you guys later, you guys. Okay, so I'm just sitting here and, uh, Still looking a mess, still looking the same as earlier, but I'm crazy and I can't stop taking tests. And I told myself I'm not going to take another test until I get the clear blue, pregnant, not pregnant. You did see a little small clip it of me showing the last bits of the pregnancy, but there was no intro or nothing explaining. Sorry, I'm looking up and trying to see if my husband gets home, but guys I am definitely pregnant and look at the difference from yesterday's to today's like talk about doubling oh my god you guys but oh my god oh my god you guys I'm pregnant it's just pregnant it's real I'm I can't believe this. I, I still feel like it's not real. I just, I don't know. Alright. For now.